Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Hope you all are doing great. Previously, we have made some videos for the people who want to get allocated for the projects who are still on bench. But now in this video, we gonna discuss for the people who want to get released from the projects. For example, some people will get allocated to some ABC project without their concern. And now they are not interested to work for that project. So in this video, let us discuss how to get released from that particular project and what are the positives and negative consequences of getting released from the project. But before moving into the video, if you are new to this channel and haven't subscribed to our channel yet, then do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you will get the notification whenever we upload a new video. So coming back to our topic, as I said, there are many people who are working for the projects which are not interested to work in. Because we all know that in TCS, they will allocate the employees to the projects according to their business requirements. They will not consider uh, the skill set which employee have and the interest which employee have in. They won't consider all these. They will uh, directly allocate it to the projects according to their business requirements, sometimes only. And uh, also, we know that in TCS, it is not an easy thing to get released from the projects once get allocated, right? But still, there is a chance. Releasing from the project will depend on your manager or supervisor and the connection you have with them. First, you need to ask your supervisor or manager to release you from the project by giving a valid reason. I am repeating again, you need to give a valid reason only because they won't consider silly reasons to release. And convincing your supervisor or manager is not an easy task because they don't want to release you from the project. You will be like a valuable resource for them. They might have already spent a lot of time and money on you to training you and make you fit for their project and their work. So. Obviously, uh, losing you means losing their efforts, right? So, they uh, don't even think to lose you from their project. But if you give a proper and valid reason to get released from that project, then they might get think and they might get convinced. For example, the reasons like if you have some skill set and have some certification in something and you are interested to work on that only, if you want to change your domain uh, or you want to change the technology, give the genuine reasons and ask for the release. And if you have any health concerns, you can tell them also. They will definitely consider your reason. If it if it has come to uh, health, then they will definitely consider it. Uh, if you can convince your supervisor or manager, then you can easily get released from the project. The 90% uh, of your uh, process is said to be complete once you convince your supervisor or manager. But try to give the valid and proper reasons only. Don't give any stupid reasons like I don't like the manager of this project or I don't like the uh, team members of the project. Like that, don't give the stupid reasons to get released from the project. Give the genuine reasons and which are valid and proper. Right? After getting the approval from your supervisor or manager, follow the process to get released from the project. So you will get released from the project like this way. And now you got released from the project. So, after releasing from the project, definitely there will be both positive and negative consequences. So, let's see uh, the positive consequences first, means the advantages which you have after getting released from the project. So, the first advantage is you might have a chance to get allocated to the project which you are interested in. Means you are not interested to work in some project and get released from the project, then you will be uh, like you will be conscious in selecting the next project right so you might have a chance to get allocated to the project which you are interested in and the second advantage is you can choose the technology which you want to work in by attending the project calls means uh, if you get allocated to the project your first project without your concern uh, without getting any project calls then uh, you might have a chance to get the project calls uh, while allocating to the second project right so you can choose the technology which you want to work in. 
and the third advantage is if you want to be on bench and want to prepare yourself for something else then you can utilize that bench period so these are all the advantages you have once uh, you get released from the project so coming to negative consequences i mean the disadvantages after getting the uh, getting released from the project the first disadvantage is if you get released from the project you will be on bench so you might already know what if you are on bench for a long time right you won't get the performance pay you won't get the hike as there will be no appraisal process for bench associates uh, you might also lose some benefits like being on bench uh, i have already made a video on this if you are uh, what if you are on bench for a long time so if you haven't watched that video go and watch there will be some uh, disadvantages on being bench also so this is one disadvantage of getting released from the project and the second one is uh, there is a chance of getting directly allocated to the other project which is same as the previous project by considering their previous experience so this also might happen sometimes there is uh, no guarantee that you will get the project calls for the second uh, project allocation right so there is a chances of getting directly allocated to the project which is not interested now also so this is one of the disadvantage so like this there are uh, both uh, advantages and disadvantages as well after getting released from the project you have to face all this so this is all i want to share with you if you feel uh, you get some information from this video then please like the video and subscribe to our channel for more information thank you